collage is a really great way to fill in large areas on your box if you don't want to paint them and it also gives you a chance to add some cool texture to your box as well so I'm just using a large piece like a full-size sheet of colored paper and I'm kind of I'm estimating how much to cut off so I kind of I'm not going to do like a measurement where I I measure carefully I'm just going to try my best to have it fit and I've also folded it slightly at the bottom to get it to fit in there so once I have my paper sort of sized approximately I can use some materials so in this case I'm just gonna use these paint sticks you could use markers crayons paints whatever you have I'm just gonna add some sort of texture that kind of to make it look like a forest or just a green space um, you could also make an actual drawing um, of your landscape and and have it uh, a little bit more detailed if you like so to secure your paper into your box, you could always use a glue stick. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mixture of glue and water. So first I'm going to grab some water and then I'm just going to get some of my white glue and pour some of it into the bowl. So I've probably used about a quarter of the bottle of glue. And for that size of bowl, just a small amount in the bottom of the bowl of water. And then I'm going to mix it together. So you don't want it to be too watery and you also don't want it to be too gluey because then you'll end up using a lot of, of extra glue that you don't need. Okay, so I'm going to start out by painting the glue and water mixture all over the area of the box that I want to stick my paper to. Okay, so then I'm going to take my paper, and this is where I kind of made a little bit of a mistake. I, I'm going to carefully place it in, but I want to um, smooth down the paper sort of from one side to the other. So like maybe from the top to the bottom. And, and do um, you know a really good smoothing. So I didn't spend enough time smoothing. My paper got a bit wrinkly. And then we want to cover the top part of the paper with the white glue mixture as well. Another way that you can do collage is you can use scraps of paper um, and tear the paper instead of simply doing uh, just one big sheet. That kind of got in the way for the filming of this part, but you basically just rip little sheets of paper they could be ones that you have added texture to, or they could be um, magazine pictures or, um, you know, special types of collage paper, whatever you like. And you do the same method where you uh, paint the glue underneath and then you place the paper and then you paint the glue over top and it makes a really nice effect uh, as well. 